Hopefully. Wait, is this going to really screw up the story if, like, I don't do it? Might have to replay this out. This might be one of those that I have to, like, actually fix. How long has she been mixing these for you? You are stalling, Eivor. Tell me what you've learned, what news from the north. The pigs were beaten back. We took their lives and their treasures. Farovid asked me to deliver this. Is he taunting me? These goblets are a cruel joke. He is mocking me. We did capture some barrels of Frankish black. He said they were for you, but I made him open a cask. We drank together. There was no poison. Speak without guise, Eivor. Does he plot against me or no? Does he keep secrets? Give me something I can use. Now so you must choose between treason and madness. So we tell Hafton, is that what we're doing, Haf uh, Devin? Hafton expects the truth. If I'm not careful, these lies will pile up one upon the next. You have grown awfully silent, Wolf Kissed. Ooh, this is tough. Devin says don't keep it. So I'm going to go with it. Let's see here. Hopefully, Faravid doesn't die, because that would be really shitty. I said he was telling the truth, basically. The game is vague about whether he actually was poisoning her, him or not. But do we tell him that he's planning the attack? Because I feel like I don't want Faravid to die. This is one that I'm a little crossed on. Up to you, you'll see. Mm. Okay. Farovid has planned an attack on the pigs at Marcus. Without you. I said option two, but you're just... God damn it. Glory eater. When? Tell me. I won't know until we meet again at a place called the Walls. Good. Go to him. Watch. Listen. Unearth his lies. He hasn't lied yet. That's the thing. If you fear poison, Lord, you must consider everything. Even Moira's brew. There we go. Impossible. Moira has been with me for an age. She is no witch. She is kind. Hmm. Hmm. Find out for yourself. She stays within Donacaster, not far from here. If you learn something, find me north of Donacaster. One of my I think it's the young guy. That's like his second in command. That's who I think it is. I should see Myra about this brew she's been feeding Hafton. Yay! Oh, that was so not good. <laughs> Let's see where she's at. We're going south, so that's the right direction. Be my eyes, 
What am I looking at? Oh, here-ish. Okay. Mario's not here. spoke at the feast about my wife's condition, but I fear that it is worse since I fear that she may not wake again. Please, I beg you. This okay. Weak. She must have gone there. Alrighty. I'm taking her snacks, though. I should go to Wake. Find Moira. Where, exactly? Oh. Wherever this place is. Southeast of Udashir. <laughs> That's how you gotta say it, right? They had other wolf mounts to ride that weren't part of the store. You guys have any interest in uh, Outriders? I think that's like delayed to like February, right? Somebody was saying the other day it was delayed again, so maybe it's. Further back than February now. I got an elk after the Jotunheim quest line, but it felt unrealistic, so I went back and bought opals. Oh, uh, oh wait, hold on. I went back to the horse I bought with opals a few weeks ago. Oh, I got you, I got you. I'm trying to like read through this, this thing. That I've tried to move around so I don't have to keep reading through the damn uh, X's and O's over here. I'm trying to like move it around. I'll figure out a spot for this that actually works. Uh, I do know about the weekly challenges. Yeah, there's, there's the contracts for the Opals, but I know there's the individual challenges, right? To do on a weekly basis. And it's the same thing with like, uh, whatchamacallit? It's the same thing with Division. Go to the main menu and click Ubisoft Connect, and then go time limited, and you see where they are. Ah, I see. I got you. It's a small village. Marva's house must be near. <laughs> see if I can get this dock as a fast travel, maybe. Oh, there we go. Easy. Oh, itchy nose. <laughs> Let's see where she's at. Is, is Moira the baddie? Find out. I bought the uh, dra Dragul. Is that how you say it? Tattoo? Come on out of there, you heathen lover. What's going on here? What is this ruckus? Stand back, gang. There's a witch within that house. Uh huh. To burn it down. She's no witch. She's Hafton's healer. That proves it. Dark magic, that is. Drugger. All of you. Before I beat you senseless. Pronounce drug. Drugger. You gotta add the uh. Drugger. Like you're half drunk. <laughs> Alright, let's see what's going on in here. Moira, we must go. Before they burn your cutters to cinders. I can't go out there. They'll steal me away and burn me at the stake. All right. I see two ways out of this, but neither is without risk. Do what you must, only hurry. I leave myself in your hands. I'm as good with words as I am with weapons. It will take some convincing, but I can talk. You know, <laughs> your father's from Denmark, so you know the pronunciations. <laughs> I got you, man. All right, so how do we get her out of here? We're not talking our way out of this. All right, let me go talk to the mob. I'm not opening the front door, though. All right, this guy. Go home, all of you. This woman is in my care now. 
Who died and made you sovereign of Northumbria now? My fists. I am the wolf kissed, killer of men, feeder of ravens. Stand back, or I will wear your bones as ornaments. Jesus. E ease up now. We was only protecting our hamlet here. Tell Hafton he can have her. That's pretty good. Leave this woman alone. Even look her way again, and it will be the last thing you see. Moira, you're safe to go. So maybe it's maybe it's not her? Hang on, let's see what this says. Is God testing me? Put a heathen man who forsakes the love and sacrifice of Christ to some to test him his ability to love others, to love my enemies. I mean, okay. Uh, mother, you taught me to love all regardless. Even as I am shunned by my brethren, I am trying my best, mother. Alas... Not enough to save, I hope. Okay. Hmm. Where'd she go? I'll wear your bones as ornaments. That's like if Doom Guy had like a line. <laughs> Doom Guy would probably say something like that. We'll be safe here. Thank you, Eivor. A thousand times I thank you. And if I asked you to drink your own brew? I would, gladly. And often do from time to time, to ensure it's not overly bitter before serving to Hafton. Hmm. When you said there's no cure for what ails Hafton, you mean his touch in the head? I fear so. The same malady bedeviled my mother. Okay. The body breaks down and the mind falls apart over time. It's a terrible thing. Goes in your brew. Can you, uh, can your brew really cure? Can you cure his illness with such a brew? My medicine is meant to alleviate his pain, not cure it. Yeah. I fear there is no cure at all for what ails Hafton. I should return to Hafton. He said he would be at the Temple of Flora. Tread lightly this topic with him, if you would tread it at all. He is investigating leads in nearby Temple North. Yeah. Okay, so we got the new fast travel. It's not exactly north. As he starts to doubt people. No, they're talking about this, right? No. He's investigating leads nearby temple north of. Oh, north of whatchamacallit. Yeah. I'm a little crossed on her yet. I don't know yet. I mean, she's honest stating the fact that it's not going to heal or it's not going to help him. But she still gives it to him regardless. <laughs> I mean, I guess you need a job. You need a job, you know. At least she's honest about it. She's like, yeah, well, it's not really going to work, but oh, crap. Devin, were you happy when they fixed the mounts in the game? When I came back to the game, like, this, I think I came back to the playing this game this week. It was awesome that they fixed the mounts. That you could actually go up hills and stuff. Zunin, guide me. These definitely weren't Skyrim horses. No, definitely not. You would you would come to like a crawl uh, on certain hills. Now that does that rarely happens now, which is really nice. Let me save real quick. Hafton, good to find you here. The raven fever returns. I keep quiet. I'm hunting a bat. Yeah, it was. It was quicker to run. Who told you there are traitors here? My scout. Asked me to join him here, but he is nowhere to be found. Have a look around. Tell me if you see something. Hey, Mark. Search the perches and look out here. I need your eyes, my friend. Okay, so he's. Hey, Mark. Search the perches and look out here. Somewhere around here. Flying from above. Hold on. Where's our guy here? <laughs> Oh, well, that's a problem. Let the weekly stuff from uh, Reda 
Didn't change this week. Oh, really? He's clinging to life. I should carry him down. Check out Jor Raptor on YouTube. He knows all things. Well, we know this wasn't what's her face because she was right near us. So that it can't be her. The lady we just talked to. You got uh, oh how you got the hidden Isubo? Still haven't gotten Excalibur yet. I found your scout, but his wounds are grave. Poor fool. He will be buried with honors. Excuse me. Walk the bridge, old friend. I will see you on the other side. Be on Tron may track his attackers. Get them, boy. Good boy. Follow their trail. <laughs> He's like, yeah, I'm right. Okay, no, hold on. Sniff them out, boy. We will paint the ground with their blood. You saw that the uh, the AC franchise was on sale on Steam the other day, Devin. Actually, it's on sale till February first. Looks abandoned. Are you sure some of the trail ends? But he's here. Dog, I'll find him. Search the okay. So I'm probably in here, right? I was gonna say, haven't I been in here before? Have I done Vinland yet? Uh These pipes first, blood at the tunnel. Even this old Roman work cannot withstand ice of this. I don't think so. Look there. The pipes cut through that wall. Should there be more rooms beyond? I've been here before, yeah. Yeah, I don't think I've done the North America stuff yet. Yeah, I've definitely been here before. Find the key. Force open. Hey, can't do this alone. Well, now I know why I couldn't get into this door before. I'm gonna be here all day, huh? Where's our guy? Oh, is there something there? Where are you, you doofus? Come down the ladder. You come back here with Hafton later on. Yeah, but he's, uh... Does help Hafton find a way... Oh, there he goes. Okay. Fixed. Maybe not. Fixed. <laughs> we're good, we're good. I just gotta lead him in here. I think I went too fast. Yeah, I was in here for like 40 minutes one stream, just like, why can't I do anything here? Give me a hand with this. I was going under the water trying to find an entry into the room. Okay, so we gotta figure out who's the baddie. Craftsman. These chambers are vast and decorated, and laced with piping. Yet they went mad and vanished, just like their gods. Mm, not exactly. Ah, here, you see? Spoils of war. Mine! Stolen from me! Oh! <laughs> <Whee>! <laughs> I am beset on all sides. By plotters and schemers. What kings and jarls are not. Your territory is vast and wealthy. 
And stop training for Ninja Warrior. <laughs> She means well. I don't believe she would poison you, not willingly. Mm. She also said she has seen your illness before, in her own family. Said it came on slow, but was incurable. No. No, this is not an illness. This is poison. Somehow someone is poisoning me. Shh. Listen. Yeah, I heard somebody. I heard a footstep. So we got the, the key. Let's get out of here. Aha. Uh -huh. I freaking knew it. Well met. Come, fill your bellies with me. You stole this tribute. It's my right. This is mine. It was meant for me. You stole nothing. Faraday gifted this to us for a hard day's battle. And did you take my scalp, Olaf, in that battle? Your brother in arms? Did he too have to die for this tribute? That was... That was Olaf? Damned fool! We thought he was a thief! The only thieves here are the ones drinking my mead and spit-shining my silver! You! Cowards and traitors! We are owed this bounty, Jarl! For battles won and blood let! Eivor, you tell him! I don't know, like, I don't have enough to go on to call them traitors. It is took stuff. I, don't, I wouldn't say they're traitors yet. I didn't find any notes either, giving me information. They only took their rightful share. You are traitorous worms. But Eivor seems to think you deserve pity. So I will give it this once. Return my spoils to Donacaster, and I will wipe this day from my memory. I can't do that. It is our share. And now you're dead. We for it. <laughs> I tried. Bled for it. Bled for it. If we don't get the glory, we deserve our share. Oh! Well, that solves one problem. I don't have to think it's him now. Didn't really force your hand. <laughs> Not me. He forced my hand with slights and trickery. He <laughs> I don't think this dude's Yeah <laughs> Tevin's like, yeah, eh like <laughs> I mean we could have just taken the stuff and told him that he can't keep it. No, we gotta throw a hammer on the guy's head. Okay. <laughs> Forced my hand. Oh, okay. <laughs> I do. At the waltz. Yes, I know the place well. It is on the road between Jorvik and Turinga. Press him, Eivor. As hard as you can. Never let up. And bring me proof of his treachery or otherwise. Bro, I will slap the shit out of you. You're not going to kill me. No, they had no <laughs> right to... It's rightfully mine. Um, I missed this, what you said before, uh, Traveler, when you, uh, when you complete most all the areas and meet a tribe of Native Americans, it's cool as, it's cool as hell, and there's a badass part that calls back to AC3. AC3, oh, okay, cool. I'm trying to remember, it just took me a second, that's the, that's the Native American AC. Uh, what is that, uh... What's the, what's the title of AC3? Is it, um... 
It's not revolution. Re revelation? No. I can't remember. Where are we going here? Meet Farabid. It's just Assassin's Creed 3? Is it? Yeah. But that's the one about the, um... Is that about the American? Yeah, you play as Connor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, that's the one about... Um... That's the one with George Washington and Paul Revere, right? And all that stuff. I don't remember it. Right. Yeah, okay, cool. And that's where everybody lost their mind with, like, the snow effects. I just lost my mind with the snow. Because trying to walk around and that stuff drove me nuts. Yeah, they had some pretty cool settings. I, I remember I couldn't figure out... This was... I believe it was Syndicate. With uh, the brother-sister, right? That was Syndicate or was that... um. Damn, there's like 15 of these games. Um, was it Syndicate or was it... It had to be Syndicate, right? Which was the brother and the sister. And like they had that crazy like puzzle for the gear at the end of the game. It was like a bunch of cogs and stuff like that. I don't know. It was really cool though. Yeah, never played Syndicate, but I have it on Xbox. Xbone S. Yeah, I can't keep track of the Xbox titles. There's Xbox One X, there's Xbox One SX, so there's one, you know, like, I can't keep it straight anymore. I just want to go back to the days where it was, like, 360, and then people were theory crafting about Xbox 720. <laughs> like, you made it too complicated, man. Like, relax. <laughs> like, PlayStation keeps it simple. They're just like, PlayStation 2, PlayStation 3, <laughs> PlayStation 4. <laughs> Just keep it freaking simple. Even Elon is like, yo, you guys got to tone it down a little bit, Microsoft. Uh, what was that? Skills, my bad. The next the Xbox one. They should just try to find a way to simplify it. Like, if they're going to... This this was the opportunity, I think, with the, with the next gen. To just be like, hey, we're... Forget all the, you know, kind of things that we've set up so far. We're just going to make it simple. We're just going to call this Xbox. And then just like, we, you could just call like Xbox whatever. It could be Xbox 6 or something. And just go back, like just make it super easy. Imagine being a parent knowing nothing about gaming and trying to buy the right console for you. That's, yeah, that's kind of what I'm getting at. Like you're, you got to simplify it a little bit for people. Especially nowadays, people just want to, you know, because they want to get things quickly and not have to deal with the headache of it. Uh, like, no, not the Series S, Mom, but the Series X, S Plus, divide <laughs> by three. <laughs> it's kind of true, though, you know? Like, even, even, um... Yeah, I mean... It's... You know, like, with... Comp Is that it? Yeah, that's it, up there. Even going back, like, for me, it was simpler. It was like, you know, like, I'm obviously older, but it was simpler. It was like Super Nintendo, or Nintendo, Super Nintendo, Sega, Dreamcast, you know, um, Xbox, Xbox 360. Even then, like, Xbox was way more simplistic. PlayStation. Have a drink. You're a few horns deep already. <laughs> Yet still floating. Tell me, how did my old friend like his goblet gift? There were other things on his mind. Your man Ulfra, for instance. He died protecting the spoils he stole from Hafnim. Ulfra. Poor Ulfra. I told him to mind your tongue, but he wags it like a slobbering dog. Was Hafton always so easily riled? No. Riches and glory have shaped him into something new. He is not the same man he used to be. Oh, man. 
What is this place? I expected an army ready for Warcraft. Warcraft? <laughs> this was our first camp in Northumbria. I came here with Hafton and his brothers, Uba and Ewald. We besieged Jorvik and put King Alla in the cold ground. Those were good days. Now, too far gone. What is all this? My share of the treasure we took from those distant days. I buried it here for a rainy day. This bag is heavy with silver. Enough to pay for an army. Interesting. Come, race me to Jorvik, Eivor. Remind me of the glories long gone. You're too drunk to win a race. Then have a drink. Make it fair. What's keeping you, friend Eivor? Taking a drink. Alright. Uh, can't wait till I actually... Oh, yeah. Okay, hang on. I like four. Hang on. Um, trying to remember which channel it is. I think it's 5-6. Is that better? Am I supposed to follow him or... I still have to me mess with my volume settings. Is that better? Or did I not turn up the right uh, setting? Figure it out in a second. Trying to figure it out. It should be better. I hope. Oh, we're off this road. Game volume is still the same. Maybe I turned up my channel then. Hang on, I'll figure this out. Having trouble keeping up. My horse must be deeper in the cups than I am. What are we doing in Yorwick? You haven't said. Paying a visit to our kept King Rishiek. Long may he reign. Okay, that's not. To beat the Picts alone, but with Rishiek and his spirit, we'll finish them off. There we go. You would bring a puppet king into this fight, but not your Yaw? Keep this to yourself. Better. The streets have ears, the windows have eyes. I did not agree to this level of deception. You should have told me this before. Eivor, my friend. If I describe my full strategy, we might never leave the campfire. I prefer the light of a fire to the darkness of your plans. Don't do it again. Yeah. That should be better. Because I changed the motherboard out, so I think the motherboard has, like, pre-volume settings to it. Or, like, presets to it. Nah, man, I appreciate you telling me, because if it's too low, then, like, nobody can hear what's going on. But, yeah, if there's... So yeah, I changed the motherboard out because we changed the processor and all that stuff, so... Perfect now? Awesome. Let's save this real quick. I've been afraid to touch even a drop of wine since the Yuletide feast. One more reason to stick with A. Uh-oh. OBS don't crash. Wait. A favor I must ask of you. Make no mention that Hafton is ignorant of our plans. It's better this way. Are you mad? Risha answers to Hafton. 
You put this man in grave danger if he defies his master's will. Rishi I cannot defy orders he has never heard, no? Trust me, I will take the blame should our plan fall apart. Alright. Do we trust him? Eivor the wolf kissed and half done's cupbearer. <laughs> what a curious surprise. I hope the day finds you and Jorvik well. Yes, we scrape by with what little we still own. But this new war should make us wealthy once again. Until our tribute is taken. I smell the bile on your breath, king. Do not forget who is in charge here. Oh, do remind me, Faravid. Yesterday it was half done. But today, I hear whispers that you are leading the charge. I am confused. Yes, you answer to half done. And now, he orders one final strike on the picked stronghold at Magnus. To make war with the North on such a scale will require a hefty amount of silver and a large force of men. My soldiers and silver are pledged already. I expect the same from you. I have given my aid as well. The battle must be decisive. I see. And you have these orders from half done in writing, yes? From the great man himself? Hafton knows, Hafton does not know. <laughs> ah, let's just make bad decisions, doesn't matter. Not with us, but you can rest assured Hafton has need of you. He expects a swift victory. I'm sorry, Faravid, but duty compels me to refuse. Without strict orders from Hafton, I will not risk the lives of so many. You deny me? I do. To gift you an army puts my wealth and reputation at risk. That's not what Hafton wants. He needs a strong and loyal king. You presume to know what Hafton wants. Hearsay is not enough. For all I know, this is another of Hafton's tests. Well, I guess we're on our own. That's okay. Alrighty. <sighs> Greatest snake in Northumbria, that Saxon is. We need his army to take Magnus. And we'll have it. If we fortify orders from Hafton ourselves. You would do this? Draw up fake orders and pass them off as real? That's it. And I know just who to speak with. Pure of Jorvik. He'll know what we need. Good. Jor's favorite alehouse is nearby. Seek him there. All right. I feel like we're getting set up in a very, very big way, and we're gonna wind up, like, out of all our gear. This is just not gonna go well. <laughs> uh, he over here, maybe? Where am I looking? Show me what lies ahead. Oh, that is definitely not where I needed to go. Okay, so we're over here. Excuse me. Devin, you're mostly into RPG stuff, though, right, man? Just out of curiosity. I'll cost you more than bread. Take you a better under Arden. You're, you're just where I hoped you would be. Pretty much, okay. I've come at just the right moment. Right then, watch this. Go home or get hurt. But you won't bother my friends. Don't bother who I please after I brick your face to the brains. Oh. Oh, good night. We got. Uh, come on, come on, big man. Our guy lost already. All 
All right, let's go. Oh, that's cheating. Smoke screen. Oh, there she is. Thank you, old kist. Those men will wake up soon enough. With greater sense, I hope. What brings you back to Jorvik? Secret errands for Hafton. Excuse me. I need an army of men to face the Picts in the north. Has Hafton planned an attack he cannot afford? That's not like him. What's to be your... clear, Faravid made this plan, not Hafton. Does Hafton know of this plan, or...? He doesn't. But he's given me leave to act as I must, for reasons I cannot share. Yes, we've heard the rumors, and all our messages have gone unanswered. Can you aid me with some trickery? Help me forge a set of orders from Hafton himself. Force Rishia's cooperation. You will be taking quite a risk. You have my thanks. I guess he just agreed. Meet outside the royal hall, after you have the dust. Just do one of those. <laughs> What's your, uh... I was gonna ask, what's your uh, favorite RPG so far? Get out of the way, doofus. You both seem to <laughs> settle well in the city. Yes, we do enjoy the comforts we have here. But I still think about Norway. The cold and the warmth. Stay on the road safe, Eivor. I try to. Ooh, okay. I feel like that dialogue was supposed to be a little bit longer, but it's all good. What's your three for sure? Just pray that King Rishia sees nothing amiss. I trust you know what you're doing. Eh, I don't think we know what we're doing. Oh, you're a lore hound. Okay. Okay. Hmm. Yes. Yes. Well, if Hafton's loyal mules have pledged to fight, still, my help will come at a price. That's kind of an ass. King of Koi. I remind you that your soldiers are mine. Hafton's, my good man. Hafton's soldiers, for these are Hafton's orders. Correct? But I jest. I jest. All is in order then. If Hafton commands, I shall raise my feared, and you shall have your fighting army. Good. Get them marching at once. This must happen soon. As soon as they are mustered, Lord Faravid, and no sooner. I want to know how he got the floating shield on his back, because I kind of want it. Where is this? Actual Elder Scrolls lore historian? Oh, well, then it must be legit, Devin. Faravid is Hafton's man. So are the Hemmings of Nottinghamshire. As are we here in Jorvik. But not you. I don't like talk that dances around thorns. <laughs> For whom are you fighting, truly? I fight for my own. I fight for you. I mean, yeah. I fight for myself and my people. As any great leader must. Yeah. Why ask me of loyalty? What are you seeking? An innocuous question. Loyalty is a word that slides off the lips like honey. Sweet to the taste, but never lingering. There are things simmering in Northumbria, hidden from even you. Take heed and have a care. What does he mean by that? Part of it should be waiting at Stenway. From Arden. Ah, uh, Tuberus. All right. Um, where am I going? To the north. I was going to ask you where you think they can take the next Assassin's Creed. But 
Devin. I was thinking, like, uh... I personally was thinking, um... Trying to think of something they haven't done yet. I mean, I would... I would kind of be interested to see how they do a modern or close to modern version of AC. I just don't know if it would be received that well. Probably India. Um, they did that with one of the Chronicles. With one of the AC Chronicles. The Chronicles were India, China, and Russia. Yeah. Or is that like you're saying, like that's just kind of your personal preference? That wasn't an actual game. Uh -huh. Fair. That's fair. Uh, that or Germany, France before there were two separate, uh, bef that or Germany and France before they were two separate countries. That could be interesting. <laughs> 